Hi friends, Suzanne here with the newest installment of the mini series called Crafting at the Lake House. I started this one day local retreat back in 2019 and now we've completed our third event. Even with all the restrictions and safety rules we had to follow, this event was a huge success. My friend and fellow demonstrator Terry from Card Designs by Terry helped me once again where we split the work and brought together local crafters from around BC for this super popular catered first class event. If you're interested in attending the next Lake House event in June, please fill out the form on my blog sunstampin.com or in the description of this video. In the mini series, I am sharing a dozen card designs we created for the make and takes at the event. Fair warning, some supplies are from the January to February celebration catalog. So if you're trying to recreate, you may have to substitute. Hello friends, here we are with card number nine. I am using the bundle called Slim Sayings for this card design. I've started off inking up the sentiment that says you are one of a kind with uh, stays on black ink. If you're looking for an ink to give your sentiments that crisp black look, this is your ink, uh, especially if you're using red rubber. All right, so uh, let's see, here we have three pieces that I die cut. So that's balmy blue, mint macaron, and smoky slate. And I have a slimline card base here that is seven inches by eight and a half inches scored at three and a half. So I am slathering the top portion of my slimline card base with my seal plus my adhesive of choice. I'm leaving about a quarter of an inch around the uh, card base so that you, I'm not going to have adhesive sticking out. So this is the Smoky Slate die cut and it is the positive die cut, not the negative. And I'm going to adhere this to my slim line card base and then I'm going to place in some of the negative pieces. So there are two different kinds of dies in this bundle and you also get sort of like an envelope scallopy piece too, or two of them actually. They're very, it's a very unique slimline die cut and it is I think quite versatile because with this chevron pattern I think that it would be really good for masculine and then there's more of a I, I don't know what shape that would be more of sort of like a mosaic kind of look. Um, and that's beautiful as well. All right, so here is my Wink of Stella brush. You know how much I love my Wink of Stella. And I wanted to differentiate between our the actual uh, smoky slate border and the pieces that I put inside, so the negative pieces. So I covered the basic gray with Wink of Stella. And now I'm just placing in, this is the mint macaron, and I'm going to just uh, pick and choose kind of, uh, it was really nice that this particular die cut, the negative pieces sort of stuck in there, kept in the, the positive side of the die cut, so that I was able to sort of just pick the, pick sort of count the numbers <laughs> and pick the ones that I wanted. Uh, and then um, I moved on into the balmy blue color. And I'm super excited with uh, how this, how this uh, card design turned out. You could use any colors. I happen to like these particular colors. Uh, I think that it was definitely a more masculine look uh, with the gray and the blue, but I think you could do, you know, orange and, you know, fuchsia and a whole bunch of different sort of, or even more muted colors. That would be lovely as well. So I'm just finishing up putting into my 
uh, the negative pieces into the sticky <laughs> inserts there. And just as a note, these, uh, I only used Wink of Stella on that uh, smoky slate color. So there it is. And I did also leave a white card for the attendees of the Lake House event in case they wanted to do one more card base. So, and it's just as easy enough to do. You just cover your um, piece with adhesive like I did and then fit in the extra pieces. I just felt that there was so much left over that I wanted to give my the attendees um, another card. And I don't know if you've guys seen this or not, but there are beautiful envelopes that go along with this um, bundle. They're called Slimline Envelopes and they're stunning. 15 envelopes with inside printed designs, five each of three colors, soft succulent, white, and smoky slate. So that's on page 53 of the the mini catalog. So um, I encourage you to go check them out because they're beautiful. So, and let me see. So I just used my little trimmer here and I trimmed off the, I, I cut down all of the little words. You are one of a kind. And now I'm just using my scissors uh, to trim off this. It's easier than trying to fuss with a a trimmer. And then I did put adhesive behind the words. And again, you guys know that you can see all the supplies I use today uh, listed below in the videos see more section or in the supplies section of my blog. I don't know if you guys know, but I do actually have a blog and I update it very, very often. And you will find all whole bunch of extra information there too. There's lots of videos there, um, not just here on YouTube, but lots of other uh, extra things as well. So um, anyway, and those fast links will take you to my Canadian online store. You'll be able to tell if that product is in stock. You can add it to your wish list, whatever you want. And again, I would love the chance to meet you and earn your business. So here I put adhesive on the back of my words, all cattywampus, and I used those matte dots for the a little bit of embellishment. And then on the inside, and my ink pad here, my Smoky Slate ink pad really needs to be uh, re-inked, but um, it says on the inside, you really are fabulous. <laughs> so I love that. All right, you guys, that's it for now. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you again soon. Bye for now. <laughs>